Learn, play and grow together with KidsZone.com Children, in one of the previous chapters, we have learned about the parts and functions of a computer. Now, let us learn how to work on a computer. Steps to start a computer Number 1. Switch on the main power supply button. Number 2. Switch on the UPS button. If the electricity goes off, the UPS makes the computer work. Number 3. Switch on the power button of the CPU. And number 4. Switch on monitor and wait for some time. You will find a welcome screen. The first display screen that appears starting a computer is known as the desktop. The desktop holds many small pictures known as icons. The thin bar at the bottom of the desktop is called taskbar. You can open any program now as your desktop is ready. Starting a program. Let us take the example of WordPad program. To open the WordPad program, follow some steps. Step 1. Click on Start. Step 2. Click on All Programs. Step 3. Click on Accessories. And Step 4. Click on WordPad. The WordPad window will open. Resizing the window. You can change the size of any program window. Look at the corner buttons of the top right corner of the title bar. Steps to resize window are Click on the middle button. It is restore down button. Step 2. The overpad window will become smaller in size. Step 3. Again click on the middle button to get back to its normal size. Moving the window. To move the window, the steps are First step. Click on the middle button, restore down. The window will become smaller in size. Number 2. Click and hold the left mouse button on the title bar. Number 3. Drag the wordpad window to the right side. Number 4. Now move the pointer over the desktop area and click once. Number 5. The title bar of the wordpad window turns grey. This means that it is not active, but you can read the contents in the WordPad window. Number 6. Now click on the WordPad working area. The title bar turns blue. It means the WordPad window is active now. Steps to shut down a computer. After your work is finished, you should always shut down the computer. Steps are click on the start button, then click on the shutdown option. Now, wait for some time till the computer turns off automatically. Then, switch off the monitor button and switch off the UPS and the main power supply button. Please remember, if you switch off the main power supply button directly without shutting down the CPU can harm the computer very badly. Thank you for visiting kidszone.com. Please like and subscribe my channel to know more and stay updated. Don't forget to hit the bell icon.